Introducing Teleport Machine ID. Machine ID is the easiest way for developers to secure machine-to-machine -machine communications based on X509 and SSH certificates. Let's see it in action. Ben has been hired as a contractor at Acmico. He's been developing a microservice that will perform analysis on a database of widgets. He's been using Teleport database access to test queries against the staging database. But to test his microservice, he'll need to get it to talk to the production DB. Before machine ID, the team would send over an encrypted ENV file with database login credentials for his microservice. But this had a few issues. Shared credentials lacked the ability to see who was using them and when, and rotating the credentials was a pain if anyone got around to doing it. Machine ID makes it easy for any application to obtain credentials that can access resources protected by Teleport. In this case, our microservice needs credentials to access the database. First, let's edit our program to read the credentials. Ben updates his config to point to where the certs are located in opt machine ID. Machine ID uses tbot to obtain the right credentials. The microservice can now use these credentials to access the DB. Let's run our program and see what happens. Wow, nothing happened. It just worked. Behind the scenes, the microservice will use the credentials provided by machine ID to connect to the production DB. As with all connections in Teleport, there is a full audit log of the actions. Since machine ID supports AWS IAM token join method, it's easy for the service to be used for ephemeral jobs that spin up and down, making it easy for the team to ensure secure machine to machine access. At the start of the video, we talked about the issues of a shared ENV that's difficult to rotate. How are automatically rotating certificates any better? First, having short-lived credentials mean if compromised, the window of attack is much shorter. In addition to short-lived expiring credentials, Machine ID has the ability to control provision credentials and live sessions through locking. Locking is centrally controlled by the cluster administrator using tcuddle. Let's lock the bot. And now let's unlock it. Along with upgrading your developer experience, Machine ID has been designed to upgrade and improve the security of deployed infrastructure with SSH support. Machine ID is able to generate short-lived SSH configs, making it possible to improve security for systems that only support SSH, such as Ansible and Jenkins. By deploying Machine ID alongside your infrastructure services, it will automatically rotate credentials, and by default, it will renew them every 20 minutes. This greatly reduces the blast radius if the machine was compromised. All engineers and machine users of Teleport have their identity centrally mapped to a role which authorizes what infrastructure resources they can access. For example, with Machine ID, a CI CD worker may be able to SSH into a server as EC2 user in order to perform automated patching and upgrades, but can only connect to a read only database. Additionally, all activity undertaken by the service is logged and monitored using the same robust controls that Teleport provides for humans. Machine ID has been designed to consolidate all credentials for machine to machine access with X509 support for databases, kubeconfig, and SSH. Thanks for watching. Teleport Machine ID is available in both enterprise and our open source edition. Try it today. Learn more at goteleport.com forward slash use cases forward slash machine ID.